Hey, this is Joe from SoFly, and in this video, we're going to talk about a new feature that allows you to export WordPress records one by one as they are created using WP All Export. So in this case, I have a WooCommerce store on this site, and every time a WooCommerce order is created, I want an export to automatically run and export just that one WooCommerce order. So to get started, I'll go down here to All Export and select New Export. Then from the pull down, I'm going to select WooCommerce Orders. So I have some filtering options here. So for example, if I wanted to have this set up so that only orders over a certain amount or only containing a certain product were exported would trigger that export, then I could set that up here. In this case, I'm just gonna export every order as they come in. And to do that, we'll just click customize export file to continue. Now here on this page, we're gonna set up the data that's gonna be included in our export. Over here on the right, we have our available data. And then over here on the left, this is the file that is gonna be created for the export. So I'm just gonna go through and drag over the stuff that I want. I definitely wanna have the order date and the order total. Go down a little further, get a little bit of product information. I'm gonna take the SKU and the item cost. And we need some customer information. We'll take their first name and their last name. Now I'll drag some of these out of this box because we don't need them. Get rid of the title. Okay, date first, order total, we'll put that last, date, name. So we'll just drag these around to rearrange the columns in our CSV. And there you go. And you know what, let's add the product name. Just so this makes a little bit more sense to a human reader. Okay, so let's go ahead and preview this. And we can see here, so this is what our CSV would look like if we were exporting all 5,651 of them. Um, and this is a sample of those. And you can see we, here we have multiple rows per order. That's because these people have purchased multiple products per order. So we can go down here to advanced options and we can unselect display each product in its own row. Go ahead and preview that again. And there we go. So now each row is a distinct order. And that's what we wanna see. So we'll go ahead and dismiss that and continue. All right, now here's where we enable the real-time exports. We're gonna select export each WooCommerce order in real time as they are completed. So this export is going to run every time a new WooCommerce order is added that meets the filter requirements that we've configured. We haven't configured any filters, so they're just all gonna export. And then here we have a link to our documentation that explains the feature in a little bit more detail. That's all we need to set up. So we'll go over here, save and run the export. And it's just going to export one, the most recent order for us. And that way we can give it a test. So we'll download our test CSV. And there we are. So that is our CSV export. Now, what's next? So now when this export, the next time a WooCommerce order is created, this export is going to run. What's going to happen? By default, nothing is going to happen. The only thing that will happen is the CSV will be updated um, so that it has the latest WooCommerce order in it. What we need to do now is set up an integration either with Zapier or write some custom code using our API or something like this. So every time that export runs, something happens. Um, if you check the description below, we have a video on how to set up Zapier exports and we have a link to our API documentation. So you can easily write some code that executes whenever this order would run. So this is a new feature for us and we are super excited to see all of the interesting things that you folks do with it. If you give it a try and find it useful, please shoot us an email and let us know how it goes. We'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.